I believe you have a live camera with Ronnie Jackson. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Senator, sir, you're definitely not withdrawing. You're going to continue this process, sir. How you doing, Ryan? My pleasure. pleasure to meet Thank you, you, sir. Thank you. Hello, Hi, sir. Brian Hall. Hello, pleasure. Thank you. Andrea, I'm not sure if we're still up here or when you took that, but we uh, we had a chance to ask Dr. Jackson these same questions again. He gave very much the same answers that he did on arriving in uh, Senator Moran's office here for this meeting, which was previously scheduled, saying that he's looking forward to answering the questions that the senators have about him and about his background, but not taking the opportunity to answer any of those questions. I listed off some of what have been the reported allegations against him in other news organizations. He did not address any of them specifically. I asked him if he would categorically deny that any of these allegations are true. He wouldn't do that either, but says he wants to keep going with this, essentially wants to answer these senators' questions, although at least uh, not in this moment in time. Uh, but again, sounding very much like a man who intends to continue, does not intend to withdraw. And again, here meeting with a Republican senator on the committee that will have to approve him. So doing the legwork to get past what is now this uh, uh, postponement of his hearing for an indeterminate period of time. Let's in fact play that tape of you uh, cornering him there on the, in the hallway on Capitol Hill. Dr. Jackson, can you say anything at all about these allegations that have come out against you in the last few days? No, I'll just say that uh, I was looking forward to the hearing tomorrow, uh, kind of disappointed that it's been postponed, but I'm looking forward to getting a reschedule and answering everybody's questions. You've seen the allegations, a hostile work environment, allegations about potentially drinking on the job, over-prescribing medications. Are you saying those are categorically untrue? I'm saying I, 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 I'm looking forward to the hearing so we can sit down and I can explain everything uh, to everyone and answer all the senators' questions. Was so. there an IG report about the allegations? No, there was not. How much betting on the White House to be for you were formally announced as the nominee? Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Senator, sir, you're definitely not withdrawing. You're going to continue this process, sir. How are you doing? Very My pleasure. pleasure to meet Thank you, sir. You. Thank you. Hello. Hi, sir. So, Garrett, he, uh, as you just pointed out, clearly not answering the questions now, but proceeding as though this nomination is going ahead. This is to be, to be continued. This is obviously a major story, a major setback for the White House today. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.